village in southern Alberta is relying on its youngsters to boost the economy. Nobleford's business community is meeting with students to explore opportunities that benefit the whole community. Alicia Fieldberg reports. I'm no more about technology than my mom and dad. People in Nobleford recognize that kids aren't only the future, they're important for the village right now. Nobleford has less than a thousand people, 200 attend the local school. The village doesn't have a chamber of commerce, instead more than 75 members of the business community are visiting the school to network. It's all about relationships, that's what business is. Uh, school is part of the business in Nobleford. The meetings also promote the benefits of hiring students. Several teens have already been working in the municipality. Many have done mechanical work or created websites and artwork promoting local businesses. Some hope starting locally will help launch their careers. Everything has to start locally before it goes globally, right? So it's important to really realize where your options are in the small places before you can go to the big places. It wasn't just labor jobs in a rural setting that are available here in the village and in the area. There's a lot of wonderfully high paying jobs uh, that are, you know, that require a lot of skill. The partnership is vital for the survival of the school and the village. Schools are the heart of small communities and a big selling point for the village. Engaging students pays off now and in the future. It's good to know that there are jobs available to uh, uh, support you and your family and have a creative life here where you grew up and enjoy. In recent decades, it's been common for youth to leave small communities to take high-skilled jobs. But many modern careers offer the opportunity to work wherever you call home. Alicia Fieldberg, CTV News, Nobleford. Nobleford recently attracted a large business that employs hundreds of people.